Whoa! It's the illusion. Reporting from somewhere on Spaceship Earth. I'm in the driveway, warming up the Terra Cruiser to go. I don't know where. It's Saturday and I have no idea what I'm doing. But uh, I do know something about today. Today started with censorship. So uh, all of those limited viewers who had caught the WoW Chronicles Chapter 1, there's not going to be a Chapter 2. The WoW Chronicles are never coming out. They have been kiboshed by my partner in crime back in the day. I get it, man. I think he's trying to be legit out there. And uh, yeah, fear and loathing and Flagstaff isn't gonna happen. Oh well, the hottest is my boy was like, we'll make a screenplay of it. And I'm like, dude, I'm one of those. Like, no, that was it, that was, that was the big moment where it was all going to be thought about for a second and it's not going to happen, which takes me into a trippy different direction because you see censorship on any level is the bane of a free society. And I get, I get why my boy doesn't want the story told. Because we don't live in a free society, man. The cops are everywhere listening in on everything. The FBI and the NSA are listening to this transmission in my phone right now. And they listen to everything on YouTube and Facebook. And so some people fear that. See, I don't fear that at, on any level. Like, fuck the man. And, I, you know, I try to keep my profanity down. But on that one, that's a, that's a free pass because... Dude, if, you got, if you're going to let the man push you around, the federal government and the police state grid that is developing all around us, then you're living in the lowest vibrational frequency, and it's called fear, man. And I, and I don't roll with fear. So, you know, my initial response to, like, being edited this morning was was annoyance on one level. And then I got to respect my bro, man. Okay, my bro asked me to like put that stuff in the can. So I'm putting it in the can all the way till the day I die, I guess, man. Unfortunately, man, it's a great story, dude. But what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Because we live in the uh, new American police state. And everyone's living in fear because their jobs can be yanked at any moment because of some tale of drug and mayhem. And like, who cares, man? Half the, half the concept of living in a free society is you can put anything you want in your body, man. Do anything you want to your body. It's do no harm to others. It's the only thing that matters, man, is, is do no harm to others. And yeah... I I don't think it's right to scream fire in a crowded movie theater. Yeah, that probably follows under censorship, no doubt about it. And, you know, violence, speaking of, of inflicting violence, yeah, I think that's a, a, a probably should be a little bit censored within reason because I don't think that it's even should be censored to say that we probably need to start the second American revolution and take our country back from the evil bankers and the NSA and this police state. I don't think that violence needs to be involved in that on any level. I think we just need to stop participating in the fear, man. And I am not going to be afraid. Though, I will stop telling the WoW Chronicles due to respect for my friend. And that's that. There's a difference between censorship and respecting your friend. And that's the bridge I had to cross this morning because at first I was pissed, man. I don't dig censorship. And then I had to like mull it all over and realize that it was something else. It wasn't censorship. It was a friend asking to have his wishes respected someone that I, I care about. So I can do that. But I know that ultimately that request comes from a fear of fear of the man dude and i've never been afraid of the man man 
what are we going to do? Are we going to live in this little police state everyone's erecting around us? Are we going to show some courage, some moxie, and get it together and tell the man to beat it? Now it's bordering on a rant, and we're not going to go there. Anyway, it's the illusion. I'm out to see what the world has to offer today. Peace.